Hey everybody out there, it's your brown bear Chris Nicholson. Happy Holidays, Merry Christmas. I want to show you something that I just learned. How to make um, home style popcorn in the microwave and it came out really, really, really good. So, let me show you this, let me turn this around. What you're going to need is these things right here. First, you're going to need your popcorn kernels. These right here are organic yellow popcorn, which is really good. This is gluten free, but we're going to make it gluten. Because <laughs> of the gluten, we're going to put butter right here. And this is actually, uh, you're going to melt this butter. So that's going to be the melted butter. And over here, this is the movie salt. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to open up the movie salt. And this is what it looks like right here. See, that's that's the movie salt right there that's inside here. So I'm going to take a spoon and put that much. This is basically like a teaspoon of movie salt. So that's all I need to put on there. And you're going to need one more thing, which is up here. And it is vegetable oil you need some vegetable oil so that comes later so this is going to be melting this is actually the popcorn salt and the butter so you put that in the microwave make sure it doesn't spill over and everything and this right over here this is called a um a barrelette go i think that's what it's called a barrelette go and this is going to be your popcorn maker. This is actually made out of rubber. I can't believe it. It's made out of rubber. And this, it kind of folds like a hat and stuff like that. So, it comes in a bowl, just like that, which is pretty cool. It has these little tool handles. And so, what you can do, let's see if this is melted enough. It's okay. It's not fully melted. So, let's, let's melt it up just a little bit more. Um, so, meanwhile, the the butter is actually melting. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna open up my organic kernels right here. There we go. Let's see, let's open this up. You know, stupid me, I think I already have one already open, but it's okay. There we go. Okay, so the butter should be melted. There you go. The butter's melted right there. What you're going to do is you're going to take your spoon, and I had I had a spoon somewhere around here, so I'll take another one. You take your spoon and mix that all up, just like this. So the salt is actually mixing in with the butter, which is very good. Okay. Take your popcorn kernels, and you see the bottom right over here. Actually, what you're going to do is Fold it up like that. That's how much popcorn kernels. That's how much popcorn kernels that you can actually put inside here. So you're gonna put the popcorn kernels right there. That's good. That is perfect. That's gonna be enough for like a whole bowl. And then pour this on top, just like that. Let that all go in there real good with the salt and everything. That's good. And just a little bit, just a little bit of vegetable oil. Not too much vegetable oil. It's going to be mostly butter. So like a cap, not even a cap full, just that much. That's all you need. That's all you need. And then you're going to take, you're going to take a spoon and just mix it up just a little bit. So this is what happens. Your kernels are going to come out buttery because all of that popcorn, um, you know, the kernels, uh, when it gets fluffy, it's going to exert all that butter and all that salt. It's going to be really good. Okay, so after that, what you're going to do is you're going to put up the bowl. As I said, this is like a plastic. 
And when you do this, you could put you could probably put a little little bit more kernels in, but this is all I'm going to have right now. So, eh, let's put a couple more in, just for the heck of it, like that. So that's how much kernels you're going to have in. Let's mix it all up. Make sure all those kernels get in there just like that. Everything is all mixed up. Now watch this. Put the top. As I said, this is all like rubbery kind of thing. So put the top right on top of it. And this goes in a microwave. This goes in a microwave just like that. After you put it in the microwave, I say put it in for five minutes. Because what you're going to do, and also make sure, most important, make sure you have a bowl ready. So I'm going to have this big old bowl right over here ready. So I'm going to put it for five minutes and watch this. And I hope my camera doesn't cut off. Actually, let's put it, for, put it in for six minutes. Don't worry, you're not going to burn anything. Okay. So, it's in there for six minutes. Back the thing up. Hey, if this becomes a blooper, all I want you to do is laugh at me. Because <laughs> I deserve it if it becomes a blooper. So, it's going gonna, it's gonna to heat up for a little while. Hold on, let's back this up a little bit more. So everybody, it's going to heat up for a little while. Just give it some time. The rest, I can put this back away, put this up here. See, I already had one open. I already had one open, so this is the second one I opened. Uh, maybe I can put two in one. But this is good. I got this from Publix, everybody. So this is this is from Publix. It's gluten-free um, yellow popcorn, which is good. And it tastes really good. It tastes really, really good. So let's put this in here. Save some room. There you go. And the rest I'll just put in a Ziploc bag. Alright, so it's four minutes already. And I can already hear it sizzle. So just like home style popcorn, what it's going to do is that it's going to actually cook and then it's going to come up. So you have to stay by the, micro the, by the microwave. If you put too much, it could overflow the whole microwave. So when, once it starts popping and it gets to that point, then I'll show you exactly um, what you have to do, which is pretty cool. So we're going to just wait, and I'm going to talk to you. By the way, check this out. From a tree, we got these nice tangerines. Look at all these. These are all fresh tangerines right over here. Um, I don't know. I don't like to bite into citrus. I just like to drink it. So I don't know what I'm going to do with those. <laughs> so... A lot of people going to ask me again, this is the uh, movie salt that I'm using. This is, um, I think it's all the red and stuff like that. This is kernel, kernel season. Okay, here it is. I just, I hear it. You're, you're going to start to hear it soon. But yeah, I just use this as, as the movie salt. Put this back on. And these come in many different flavors. I like the movie salt butter which gives us also that buttery feel and it's it's just just awesome it's awesome so it actually tastes like it tastes like home style popcorn at the same time it tastes like movie popcorn which is good okay so I don't know if you can hear that it's popping it's popping which is pretty cool okay so let's wait once you have to look at the microwave, try not to look at it too hard, but once you glance at the microwave, if the, if the popcorn goes a little bit above the bowl, take it out. So watch this. Watch this. It's going to probably do it. That's why I have this big bowl right over here. Uh, I did this yesterday and I ate the whole thing. It was so freaking good. I was watching YouTube and I like to watch my abandoned videos or my subway trains and everything like that. And I tell you this, it was really good. I ate the whole thing of pop, this whole thing of popcorn. Sat there and ate it, and ate it, and ate it, and ate it. Oh, I'm gonna keep on doing that. I'm not gonna do it every day because I know it's not healthy for you because all that butter. Popcorn is healthy for you, but the 
the butter is not, you know. But me, I, I love butter. I love butter. So you, you can still hear it. It's popping. And the best of all, you won't burn your popcorn. So that's that's a cool thing. It's that your popcorn will not will not burn at all. So, and neither would this this rubber thing that's inside here, the rubber bowl. It will not burn. Okay, so it's not at the peaking point yet, but it's it's getting there. It's getting there. So what I'm going to need is this, my little spoon, which is um. You know, so I don't put my hands in it because it's going to be a little bit too hot. Um, a lot of people are going to ask me where where we got this metal, or this uh, rubber bowl at, this popcorn maker, the home style. Um, I have to ask my partner about it. See if he got it for me because the one that I did on a stove, I nearly I nearly set a fire that the kitchen the fire was like this high. Up, oh, I see it peaking. Let, let me just keep on going with this a little bit more. See if you guys are watching, but I see a peaking. Let's add some more minutes on there. Keep on adding some more minutes. And check this out, everybody. There it is right there, your home style popcorn. I love this. If I just shake it, and that's all that butter that's on there, oh my gosh. I'm trying not to get any kernels. So this is what I have to do. I have to put it like this. I'm trying not to, any kernels that are in there, like you're gonna see some kernels, keep it in there. Because guess what, everybody? Even though that you took it out, you could, you could, you could do this process all over again. There you go. So, anything that's a popcorn, I'm doing that. And it's still hot, so that's good. Now watch this. Take this, put that back in there, put this on, back on top. Start the process all over again. Check that out, everybody. Home style popcorn. Mmm. Mmm, that's so good. It doesn't even need salt. <clears throat> you hear it? It's popping again. So we're going to fill up this whole bowl, everybody. Oh, that's so good. Mmm. That's the best popcorn. It tastes like movie popcorn. Mmm. Mmm, mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. That is so freaking good. Okay, so... It's popping again, everybody. Add some more minutes. <laughs> I, as I said, I don't know where my partner got this at, but after I burnt the last two popcorns on the stove, he got me this thing, and he was like, just try, just Chris, just try it, try it. I know you like your old stuff, but try it out. And so, now I'm hooked. I told him, I said, baby, could you do me a favor? Could you get me another one of these? Could you get one in blue? <laughs> But it's 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 neat. Okay, let's see. It's it's starting to peak. Starting to peak. Up. So keep on going. Oh yeah, that's a big load up there. <laughs> that's a big load. Let's see. It's starting to peak. Yep. Okay. Here's the next batch right here. Check that out. Ooh, it's hot. It's hot. It's hot. But that's the next batch. Ooh, it's hot. It's hot. Check that out. Look at that. Look at that. There's still more kernels in there. More kernels in there. You see the kernels in there? I don't know if you can see it. But we can pop those too. So, that's the second batch. Let's do the third batch. Put this back in. Put this back on top. Third batch. Woohoo! It's hot. Okay. Look how much popcorn we got, everybody. Look at this. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be in my bed with my kitty cat, mmm, chewing on this delicious popcorn. 
Mm. I should do a commercial. It's not too salty. It's not too salty, but it's very buttery. And there's just a little bit of salt on there, which is good because I mix it all up. And the, 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 the third batch is coming up. So I love this thing. I really love this thing. I thought that thing was so cool. Um, as I said, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to see if I can find the uh, commercial and everything for it. But, wow. My old popcorn can actually have inherit that popcorn maker. <laughs> and see, this is what happened with the last popcorn maker. I burnt this a little bit. Guess that's the last batch. It didn't even burn this. It didn't burn it at all, you know? But there's some there's some other kernels in there that kind of like had it and everything like that, but it's okay. It's the last batch. That's it. I'm just going to throw everything in here. I'll figure it out later. It's edible. It's edible. There was some, some kernels in there, but that's it. It didn't burn it, and this is easy to wash very very easy to wash and it's very easy to store so after you wash it you can basically just store it in your cabinet like this put this on top of it and that's it that's it so this is the name of it i can't pronounce it but that's the name of it right there if you guys want to look it up which is called um barret l g o q I think that's what it is. I don't know. I'll, I'll look it up and I'll, I'll send a link. But um, it's very easy to wash. And the ending result is this beautiful bowl of popcorn. Mmm. That is so good. But nice and buttery. Mmm. Mmm-hmm. That is so good. This is way better than movie style popcorn. So, that's it everybody. Click like, subscribe, follow me on everything. I don't have a website, but join me on my friends page. I'm going to put this on there. I'm going to put this on YouTube. I absolutely just love it. Thank you so much. Keep safe. I love you. Mwah. Happy holidays. Happy New Year. Bye-bye.